pretty uniquely positioned as a global Indian pharma company. Uh, you know, while we have a lot of manufacturing in India, actually significant part of our manufacturing and our people is outside India. So, you know, it's almost pretty much 50-50 in terms of inside India and outside. Uh, I think that allows us both, you know, kind of where, where the customers want things made. So one of our biggest businesses is contract manufacturing. So if they have a high value patented product, they actually often want it made in the US. Uh, whereas, uh, you know, sometimes if it's even if it's a large volume product, they may want it in India. So this way, I think the way we are actually set up at helps us to meet our customers where they want us to meet. Consumer products is actually only India. And I think this is a, you know, I'm very excited about it. Uh, what I see is uh, we built a distribution where, you know, pretty much in every town that's, uh, you know, 20,000 plus um, population. And we, you know, we've done the Kirana stores and the chemists and all of that. And then what, when you have online coming in and e-commerce, it allows you to do a lot more experimentation and new products, uh, pricing, advertising, and it, it helps you that give you that scale. Uh, so I think, and then you take it to, to the chemist and you actually get even larger scale. So I, I think it's a business that I'm very excited about. We look at it as a very India focused business because we like Indian consumers are very, again, becoming very focused on wellness. And if you add in the right product and the right price, uh, they'll actually are very willing to experiment and try new things. You have to listen to your consumers. You have to understand what their, both their, you know, met needs, sort of their voice needs, as well as their unmet needs, right? And say, look, how are consumers thinking yeah. actually out in the market? Um, then you are, can understand with the way the market's going.